family hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful day guys today is juma i'm here in jakarta mashallah we just prayed uh, salat al juma and uh, masjid al uh, istiqlal as you can see it's pretty uh, busy there's a lot of uh, people here just uh, finished now gonna head uh, down in Cholo and uh, grab my shoes and maybe uh, head to uh, grab uh, something to uh, eat pretty hungry i think it's around 12 30 local time here so it's basically lunch time uh, feels really nice I'm to have to, to pray here it's uh, I think uh, the biggest uh, masjid in uh, Asia um, and uh, mashallah it's really big I think five floors um, you know they have guys and ladies men and women sections uh, wadu area downstairs for both men and women huge seating area so uh, you know we don't see subhanallah these type of uh, masjids in uh, western countries and just it's because we don't have the the numbers right to to support it but here uh, it's a muslim country mashallah so there's a lot of uh, muslims and you know every corner that you go you see uh, massages so look at the number of people right now that are here just uh, finishing up their salah and head now so as you guys can see there in this corner there's a lineup over here there you uh, basically uh, when you come in you can check your shoes there or you can take it with you inside and put in a plastic bag but if you check it in they will give you a number where is my numbers number like this and then you take that number with you then when you're done your salah you come back 
and uh, basically pick up your shoes. Or at the entrance of uh, the masjid, there are actually uh, uh, the, the brothers that are just uh, giving plastic bags, which you can use to put your shoes. So if not, then you have to, once you take off your shoes here and give it to them, then you have to walk barefoot. A couple of maybe five, ten meters or something. It's not too far. But uh, just something to remember. So now let's go and uh, pick up our shoes. Terima kasih. So I was in the wrong section. So you can see there's a B. They have a number, and then here they have it numbered A. Um, you can try to remember it that way. So wherever you drop off your shoes, just remember if it's the A boot or the B boot. So that's where you can go to the to the correct location. And uh, there's actually also a, a letter on the card. You see here it says A. I didn't notice that, so I just saw it now. Um, so this way, if you guys get it, just look at that too. It'll tell you which boot. Got my shoes, it's pretty quick. So there's no line, not like you know, you have to line up or anything, you just have to kind of um, look around and find a little uh, better area, and uh, then just kind of squeeze yourself in, give the, the card, and uh, get your shoes. Because if not, if you're gonna try to wait for for line and for your turn to come, you're gonna be here for a while. So just so just so you know. Well, <laughs> I haven't seen uh, like uh, you know poor people or beggars a lot so far but just uh, see some like uh, outside the masjid they're not like in the masjid uh, uh, boundaries like inside because they have fences but they're like right outside the door so you know if you guys were in the area and looking to help uh, people you could always come here just outside the gates of the masjid there's a lot of people that are less fortunate their kids for example selling like plastic bags there's seniors Paulo, that are selling you know, plastic bags and things just to kind of make ends uh, meet. So, you know, if you are in the country and you wanted to help people, there's a lot of people that uh, you could help for sure. If you just, uh, you know, take some time to, to look around. So, let's uh, wrap it here, guys. Because um, I want to go find something to eat. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the dining table or lunch table. <laughs>